is up, Rocket Nation? And welcome back to episode number 58 of Dying Light 2. In episode number 57, we had ourselves a little bit of a history lesson. No, literally, an old man asked us questions about history. And we answered every single one of them right, which makes us the smartest humans alive. Also, may have uh, opened up a couple of our, um, what are they called, Night Runner, Night Runner hideouts, and also did another, I believe it was a GRE anomaly that we did too, so a whole lot that we got done. Today we're jumping right back in. As always, thank you guys so much for all the love and support throughout the entire series. If you guys are liking what you see, thumbs up. If you dislike it, thumbs down, and if you guys want to be notified when the next episode goes live, all you guys got to do Click the sub button, little bell notification icon, and YouTube will take care of the rest. Let's go. Now, I believe we do have a one side quest left, uh, if I'm not mistaken. Let's open up the map. Yeah, it's a nighttime one right here. The Nick. The Nick. So this is level five as well. Ooh, right on par with where we're at. Let's go ahead and uh, we'll mark that one and let's go there. My joints hurt. My joints hurt. Um, I'm waiting for a new bow to show up. Not gonna lie, I'm ready for it. I'm ready for it. I think ours is starting to get a little bit of damage drop off at this point. Um, this is happening. <laughs> Just win for it. Oh, the wondrous, amazing. This, this city is gorgeous from up here. Whee! Uh, <laughs> I'm guessing it's this building in front of us. Yeah, we're like 50 meters ahead of it. Over here. <laughs> Over here. Oh. I can't see you because the lighting in this game is funny. Uh, <laughs> what's up, bud? And I thought he was yanking my chain. What? We're yanking your what? Your boss said you'd be here earlier. My boss? Your boss, Eberhard. I don't know him. Damn it. <sighs> Sorry, don't mind me. I am Ferenc Waller. I used to be a cardiac uh, heart surgeon. I'm Aiden, but who is Eberhard? At this point... I'm not sure anymore. Some guy I met said <coughs> he'd arranged to recover a pacemaker from the medical offices in the, in the quarantine building for me. Did you pay him in advance? I did. <coughs> that wasn't too smart. Ah, oh, well. I guess I'll just go after the pacemaker myself. I promised my wife I would get it. And I intend to keep my word. So who needs it, him or her? Because he doesn't sound so good. Um, yeah, you know what? <laughs> Never even thought of that. Hey, uh, good point. What the heck is a pacemaker? Wait, what is a pacemaker? It's a little shock box to simulate the heartbeat and to keep it beating. For those suffering from damaged hearts, it was the only way to lead a normal life. They're pretty rare nowadays. <laughs> Ooh. Um, how do you know it's there? How do you know it's there? I consulted there back in the day. So I know where they keep equipment like this. Where exactly? Are you offering to go for me? Eh, why not? If I can help. Why not? Besides, you promised your wife, right? Excellent. The medical equipment room's on the third floor. But it's dangerous in there right now. I'll wait until tonight when the infected leave the building. Find shelter around here for now. I'll be at the windmill. Good luck, Aiden. Thank you. Okay, this is happening. Um, fast forward tonight. Which is cool because it sounds like we're going to a quarantine zone, which we need to go to anyways to get the, uh, to get ourselves the, oh, is this, is it? It's literally the building right across the road. Um, can we up here? 
PHV advanced care. What? Oh my god, I didn't think I was gonna be able to make that jump. <laughs> I thought I suicided right away. All right. Um, well, we don't have all day to do this, so uh, <laughs> let's get this done before. Actually, we have all night to do it. Uh, let's get this done before morning. Um, okay, so one thing I feel like we should definitely do is, um, boy, you know what? Here, let's modify this. Wow, that's 78 damage. Ooh, you know what? Let's, let's modify this weapon. Let's add flame to the tip in the shaftal regions. Uh, let's add this one, the burn, the blast mod, which is so cool. I love that thing. And, uh, I guess that's it. All right, so let's use that. We need a replacement for that weapon now. Squeeze in here. And uh, we're just going to go for it. Oh, Smokey. What up, Smokey? Um, let's work our way down. Let's waste no time. These are all the shortcut doors, basically. So that we can quickly make it down or back up if need be. Are we going down one more? We are. All right. A lot of pinging going on. Oh, Jesus. Beep, beep. Let's break stuff. Good lord, that took forever to open that one. Um, I think he probably saw us. Yeah, got him! <laughs> I'm like a zombie ninja. Well, not a zombie. I'm a ninja against zombies? I don't know. I don't know what I was going for there. Let's just quickly eliminate them all. Lot of, yes, feels good. And they said I couldn't be stealthy. Wrong. Um, so that one there is literally going to be unsneak up on. Uh, <laughs> what did he say? You heard me. Unsneak up a bowl. Baby. We are on a roll. Um, we do need a lot of materials too. That is something that I'd be keep. Oh, what is this? We got ourselves. Okay, got it. A pacemaker, boys. Well, you know that we're finishing this off. We ain't gonna just not finish it off. Uh, okay, I did something funny there. I don't know what it was, but it was it was awesome. Completely awesome. Oh my god. There are so many. Oh, we're not going that way. Uh, clearly. Oh no. Gotcha. I'm not going to get caught. They're not going to wake up and kill me. They're not going to wake up and kill me. <laughs> this is happening. F it. Get your crystal on. Oh. Was it right there? Oh, yes. I'm still the best. New gear. <gasps> um, what? 
we gotta go i don't know what just happened there but whatever it was it wasn't good um we're just gonna go we're gonna go we're just gonna go we're gonna go i'm i think i'm getting attacked right now i have no idea i got a seven it bud you got an attitude problem you deserved it um let's go I don't know what just happened back there, but that was not comfortable. <laughs> um, how many? We have three health kits left now. Actually, make that two because we need to heal. Um, <laughs> we have eight of those, the Molotovs. The heck with it. Let's go. We're gonna go. We're going back in. We're going back in. It'll be fine, right? This was it, right? This was this was the floor I think we came into, right? I think, maybe? Wait, did that just reset? I think that kind of reset everything. no way that we're getting away with this, right? I mean, we're clearly about to be bust. Did we really? How am I this good? It doesn't make sense for one to be this amazing at this game. Did you not get burned? All right, we need to uh, breathe. Take a minute, breathe. Oh, there's a lot happening right now. Wait for it. Go! Are we good? We're not good. I mean, we're good, but we're, we're not all the way good. Okay. Okay, here we go. Woo. Okay. Uh, I did a lot of I just held my breath for that entire sequence there. Uh, <laughs> nice. Never broken a lockpick ever. Definitely didn't happen in episode number 41. Um Oh, more gear. Hey, there we go. There we go. Um you know where we're putting this. There's no reason to pretend like we're not. Keep going. Um, stamina all the way. You're good. Get up. No time. Morning is almost here. Oh, tape. Um, GRE. Okay, Dr. Kasumi, report number four. Collectibles. Carl. Um... Kasumi report. Is this number four? Number four right here. These reports prepared by Kobayashi Katsumi, head doctor for the GRE, describe the handling of the THV pandemic. In this fourth report, dated April 13th, 2024, Kasumi outlined some of the actions taken by the Council of Mankind to enforce and, and uh, wait, the contam wait, the containment <laughs> protocols inside the walls of the city. Good lord, that was a tongue twister. Go. Eleven months have passed since we arrived in Villador. 
With us are the leaders of six major European countries and their combined militaries. The Council of Mankind. <clears throat> April 13th, 2024. DRE report on the state of the epidemic. The report is about Villador, the last major city left in the world. All others have fallen. This city is humanity's last hope. The Council of Mankind is doing its best to protect the city as the GRE studies THV in controlled circumstances. The protocol. Unrest among the citizens is growing as thousands of immigrants gather outside the walls. The military safeguards the border, but some leaders are worried the situation might escalate. Inside, crime is on the rise as supplies grow scarce. Civilians have started to form militia groups, patrolling the streets with guns. General Pratt ordered them to disband and confiscated all privately owned weapons. This led to many protests all over the city, attended by thousands. At one gathering, the military opened fire. 64 civilians were killed. People call it the March Massacre. I have reason to believe we are on a downward spiral now. I've never been religious. But if there's a god, then this virus is the devil. And we are in hell. Wow. Well, it just goes to show how big of a deal the March Massacre was to these people. Like, it... It, you're talking 20 years after the fall of mankind, and this moment just has stuck with the people so much that uh, it's still talked about at regular. Uh, all right, so, noise. Dr. Katsumi, always good to hear your voice. Um, there is an item over here. Let's go get it. Did we? Oh, yeah, we got to loot the bodies. We can't not loot the bodies. I need these materials for things. What is this right here? Oh, that's okay. We're going to take that. All right. I don't know how long we have until morning comes, but uh, I do know that the the nights do not last long enough in this game. In my humble opinion, they could make the nights last a little bit longer. Uh, I want to say it's like seven minutes for one morning to go by. Um, all right, okay, so that's another shortcut to get up. There we go. Ooh, don't. What the heck? Oh, no. Oh, no. I see the runner in there. Can we like lure him? Hey, yeah, come check it out. Come check me out, bro. Here he comes. Come on. Come on. Oh, he just turned around and booked it back. Here he comes again. All right, we're going to have to you bait him out here a little bit more we don't want to wake his brethren although I think we might have just done just that Okay, the rest are still sleeping. There's two more runners over there. It's too many runners. Okay. What is my guy just What are you doing? What 
was this maneuver? Knock it off. Don't ever do it again. Um, we only have two minutes left before we're gonna perish. Take that! Let's heal. We only have one more heal, by the way. You know what? Right into the crafting menu. We're not even gonna risk it. Just craft more. Craft more. You know what? We should... Oh, I don't want to craft max because... Yeah, we don't need that many. Never craft more than what you need because you never know when you're going to upgrade it and you won't need this anymore. Breathe. For the stamina. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love this weapon. What the? Did we get them? They're all dead. I hope. Loot. Really running short on time now. Um, unfortunately, I don't think we have time to sit around and wait. I think we got to go. We're, we're running short. A minute and three. You know what? We're just going to have to do this. We're going to have to, um, not that one. It is this one. We're going to have to take an immunity booster. It's got to happen. It had to happen. Oh my goodness. Why are you all awake? You should be dead. Did I just get hit there? Breathe, Aiden. No, how did this guy just go? So they've changed the behavior of the zombies since the last time that we've done an episode through an update. And I got to say, I don't like the changes. Uh, you just get hit sometimes and there's nothing you can do to avoid it. So that doesn't feel good. These guys can do a jump. These guys can do a jump at you that you just cannot avoid. And you just get hit by no matter what, which just doesn't feel good um, as the player. Here. Burn. Um, can we? Oh, yes, we can. We're doing this. Get your crystal on. Open. Right there. Got it. Give me the goods. Oh. Um. Oh, right here's our right here's our uh, inhibitor. Wow, <laughs> this is un unreal. No, see that right there. This, this thing clearly should not have hit me. Hit me? Shouldn't have hit me. <laughs> it shouldn't have hit me. No, Jesus, man. <laughs> Got him. Um, buttons, medium, lockpick, they're all easy, doesn't matter. I've never broken a lockpick ever. Definitely not right now. Got it. Inhibitoire, we got all kinds of new gear out of here. And, yes, inhibitors. 
Once the nighttime strikes, we or the uh, the daytime strikes, I feel like it's right around the corner. We gotta bail, like we gotta get out. Um, we still have another inhibitor container nearby though, so there is another one out there. But I have a feeling nighttime is getting ready to end. This one has been very long. I feel like this is about, you know, two or three floors bigger than any of the other ones that we've done so far. Um, so there ain't nothing else this way. Kind of remember the way back, too. Oh, look at Okay, so beautiful. There's our shortcut. We can take that back up. Another one right here. And open. Oh, thought we were gonna have to use our key. Got it. Um, it says we're 19 meters away. <gasps> right here. We got this. This is it. Oh, beautiful. Oh, we got some legendary gear in there too. Is there a crystal? There is. Break the crystal. And I think we're done. I think we're done here. Oh, there's a big boy in here. I don't know what is off to our right. It's something big though. There's one inside of it. <gasps> there was one inside of the wall. Where is this inhibitor container? We're getting further away from it, wherever it is. Sorry. Excuse me. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> We're not going to get busted. We're not going to get busted. Nothing else is gonna wake up and kill us. We're, we're fine. Close. Another inhibitor container. <laughs> is this, did we really just? We're done here. Get me out. Okay, okay. We're fine. We got a long way to climb back up. We should make it, I think. I do not think we need to use another one of our boosters. We should be fine here. I'm hoping. Um, climb, Aiden. <laughs> oh, we're golden. We're done, right? That is it. I'm pretty sure we just cleared the whole, the whole building is clear. Let's read about this one. What was this one called? THV Advanced Care. When the THV pandemic hit Europe, Velador was among 20 cities that became test beds for finding the cure. This is, okay, it just said the same thing. Uh, so we got all four. We got all of the, the XPs and everything for it. Was that amazing or what? We did it. Where's our boy at? 139 meters that way. Um, let's do this then. Get up a little bit higher here and do this. All right, let's go deliver the pacemaker. Oh my goodness, that was intense one right there. That was nutty. But we did it. Just gonna wingsuit down right on right next to him. What's up, bud? Found your pacemaker. Found your pacemaker. <laughs> Thank you. Now I need to arrange for surgery. I hope you can, and that your wife will be okay. My wife? Oh, I buried her last year. Natural causes. Nothing heart-related. 
I'm the one with the faulty ticker. I knew it! <clears throat> and it's running down more and more every month. Monica made me swear to take care of myself. I've been helping others all my life. The time has come to help myself. Okay, but who's gonna implant the pacemaker? Right? I'll figure that out soon enough. First step was to get a hold of a pacemaker. Now what? Continue the race against time, I guess. I can't be the only heart surgeon left in the world. I hope you find one, Doctor. And soon. Thank you, Aiden. Take care. Wow, can you believe it? Like, no, nothing shady happened there whatsoever. Combat level up! The next side quest now completed. Nothing shady happened. No, the, the guy didn't lie to me. Nothing like that. We got a bunch of, yeah. Look at the nighttime bonus. You know, we didn't get hardly any nighttime bonus for killing stuff at night uh, right there. <laughs> Feel like the XP that you get, your combat XP you get. Look at all the birds over there too, by the way. Uh, the combat XP that you get for killing stuff at night is so minuscule uh, in comparison to doing quests and stuff. It's actually insane. Um, all right, so we have parkour level ups. We have combat level ups. What are we gonna do? What's it gonna be? I'm thinking we're gonna take, uh, I think we're gonna have to do the rotate jump. I think that's gonna have to be a thing. Um, we do have the dash too. We can essentially then dart for uh, as long as we have stamina. After boost, crowd runner, the old slide jump, which I feel like is useless. Landing jump, which also I think is useless because you can kind of do that already. Um, let's take the rotate jump, I think. I think that one would be more useful than a lot of the other things that we we can take at this point. Maybe the dash might also be. Also, you know what? Fast climb would be nice too. Um, <laughs> this one could have been useful in like certain situations. Like when we were caught with all them zombies in our way, we could have just bashed through them by pressing the G key. Uh, you know what? We're going to do it. We're going to go the rotate jump right now. I feel like that's one of the, the harder ones to get to out of the group. And now for combat, uh, we're definitely, like I said, we're power shot is happening. Ed's piercing and bonus damage to all ranged weapon shots. We're doing that. Yoink. And then uh, we'll do the parkour shot at some point here in the very near future as well. So we can do it during parkour moves, jumps, tic tacs, etc. We can aim more precisely uh, by making time slow down. Oh, even when you slide, nice. Oh, that one's gonna be cool. So we need two more points to finish off all this stuff here. I can't wait. It needs to happen sooner. Um, smash jump, I want that too. All right, all right. So that'll be it. Thank you guys so much for joining me for yet another side quest here in Dying Light 2. As always, if you guys are liking the videos, thumbs up. If you dislike them, thumbs down. And if you guys want to be notified when the next episode goes live, simply click that sub button. The little bell notification icon on YouTube will take care of the rest. You will never miss another episode. Thank you guys so much. As always, remember, life is short. Pause, save, and I will see you in the next episode.